Bloom Stacks on me. You might ask yourself, what the heck is that? Bloom Stacks on me is a way of applying science to the learning process. In the 1950s, Benjamin Bloom proposed a way to categorize the thinking process. It was his thought that as thoughts in learning became more complex, they were evolving into something superior. Bloom's taxonomy is most frequently illustrated as a pyramid. The most basic representation of learning, knowledge, is at the base of the pyramid. Knowledge is the acquiring and repeating of information. It might be a simple memorization of facts, rules, or theories, as demonstrated in the first clip with Josh and Luke. What's a guitar? A guitar is an instrument that makes music when you strum the strings in a certain pattern. Like what? Like, um, just a simple... Oh, so like... After knowledge comes comprehension. As we move up the pyramid, comprehension might be demonstrated by the act of classifying, describing, or recognizing information. Facts and rules beyond simple memorization. Let's catch up with Josh and Luke. Is this a guitar? Yes. 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 Is this a guitar? No. Moving steadily up the pyramid, we now approach application. At this level of learning, the students begin to apply his knowledge and comprehension to circumstances without the need for his teacher. The student begins to learn on his own. Take it away, Josh. Wow, Josh sure learns quick. He is now moving up the pyramid to analysis. At this stage, he begins to see different parts in the relationship between them. He can now compare and contrast and critically appraise what he has learned. That's quite impressive for a single afternoon of learning. Josh is now moving on to synthesis. At this stage of learning, Josh can now compose, construct, develop, and manage his acquired knowledge. He creatively puts parts together to make a new whole, like adding an amplifier to his music. Let's check on in Josh's progress. And finally, at the apex of learning, the top of the pyramid, evaluation. At this level of learning, Josh can now judge, consider, and determine the value of the knowledge he has. Let's take one last look at Josh as he makes it to the top of the pyramid. I hope you enjoyed this illustration of Bloom's Taxonomy, illustrated by Luke and Josh. I'm Mike. Thanks for joining us.